Jury deliberations just wrapped up for the day in the trial for the former state trooper charged with the death of a teenaged boy. Michigan State Police Trooper Mark Bessner faces charges of involuntary manslaughter and second degree murder in the death of Damon Grimes. Prosecutors say Bessner fired his taser at Grimes, causing him to die after crashing his ATV into a pickup truck. Closing arguments took place this morning. We find that defendant Besner did use reasonable force, that his actions were justified. He is not guilty of count one. He is not guilty of count two. The question, ladies and gentlemen, is now always has been, is that reasonable? The answer is no. Jury deliberations will continue tomorrow. Police in Redford Township are searching for a vehicle and suspects after a 65 year old woman was killed. She was murdered in her home on five points between Telegraph and Beach on Thursday. Police say her 2006 purple Mazda 6 was stolen after that incident. A detailed description of the suspects has not been released, but police say they are considered armed and dangerous. So if you happen to have seen that purple Mazda or have any information about the murder, call the police. Both parties are starting the final frantic push for votes in next week's election. Vice President Mike Pence is making two stops in Michigan today. He was in Oakland County this afternoon to support candidates for Congress, Mike Bishop and Lena Epstein. And then he will rally support for U.S. Senate candidate John James a little later tonight in Grand Rapids. Meantime, the incumbent Senator Debbie Stabenow was on the campaign trail this morning, kicking off her Made in Michigan tour. The tour will include visits to manufacturers, small businesses, apple orchards, colleges, breweries, and other stops.